This video provides a high-level overview of how to use the SAP LeanIX calculations feature. From your starting point, navigate to the Administration section, scroll to Advanced Settings, and open Calculations. To create a new calculation, click New Calculation and choose whether to start from scratch or use an existing template. If you prefer using a template, simply select the one you want, such as the Gartner Time Assessment template, and click on it. This template automatically pre-fills key fields, including the calculation name, the target fact sheet type, and the field where the result will be stored. All of these can be adjusted if needed using the drop-down menus. Below, you will find the code that defines how the time classification is determined. In this case, the calculation evaluates technical fitness and functional fitness and, based on the assigned values, classifies the application as tolerate, invest, eliminate, or migrate. To test the calculation, click Test Run and review the results. This will show what classification would be applied to each fact sheet. You can test multiple fact sheets to verify if the code behaves as expected. Once you're done, click Save and Activate to finalize the calculation. Activation may take quite some time as the system processes all relevant fact sheets in the workspace. Now the calculation is active and on the fact sheets, the time classification is set based on their functional and technical fitness. If users identify that the technical fitness is in fact lower and would adjust the field, the time classification will automatically be updated. Let us have a look at a concrete example. Therefore, we open the application fact sheet AC management. The time classification attribute is currently detected as tolerate based on the functional fitness being insufficient while the technical fitness is adequate, if you now adjust the technical fitness, for instance, by lowering it to inappropriate, the system will automatically trigger the calculation. After refreshing the page, the time classification will update accordingly, changing from tolerate to eliminate. This change will also be reflected in the last update section, indicating that the user modified the technical fitness from adequate to inappropriate and the calculation adjusted the time classification in response. This ensures that all classifications are dynamically updated based on the latest attribute values, providing accurate insights into application assessments. Thanks for watching.